Davis. It's in. Picking up Pippen on the switch. Pippen goes all the way in to tie it up with a beautiful move by Scotty. Pippen with a dunk in the other end. Oh, on the drive to the hoop. Lays it up. Right by Pippen. Scotty on the drive. Beats Vinny Johnson with a behind the back move. Left corner, George. Michael fires. Ribbing no. Oh. It's off the rim. Dunk back in by Scotty Pippen. Left handed. Pippen on a wing. On a drive. Reverse the layup. Everybody, even myself included, thought that ball was going to Kyle Corver right there for an easy three. Look left, pass right. Oh, Come wow. on now. Hey, he's, uh, he's at the park right now. He's out there playing around, D.B. <laughs> LeBron against the long arm to Reza. In trouble. Oh, my! From behind the backboard. What a shot. An incredible shot. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Assalamu alaikum. What's good with the peeps? Man, this is your boy, Azakar, bringing you that heat like I always do. Early in the morning, afternoon, evening, at night. Man, you got to give your boy props, man. All the way, give me props by like, sharing, and subscribing. You know what I'm saying? Hit that bell. You'll be notified every time your boy drop any type of content. And you know, oh, yeah. HBO, help a brother out. Hit that cash app. Hit that PayPal up. You feel me? Man. When I say shots been thrown, shots been thrown like a Mickey Ficky. Well, you know, your boy LeBron James, he's always catching so much heat from the police and everybody else out there. Getting upset at him, throwing out, you know, false narratives and well, not 100% information, you know, going off of feelings. This is what they say now, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, he had a tweet out there, he had to delete it and all that. And so, you know, they really throwing that heat on LeBron. But this is a different type of heat right here, man. <laughs> this is coming from number 33. Number 33, Scotty Pippet. I'm going to leave links in the description box, y'all. And I got this from uh, FadeAwayWorld.net. Uh, Scotty Pippen, uh, when asked to pick between Michael Jordan and LeBron James, guess what your boy holla? I wouldn't take LeBron James to the movies. Oof, Lord, have mercy. Shots fired. Shots fired. And Scotty Pippen has been one of the most outspoken players when it comes to the GOAT debate. I mean, y'all already know what he said one time that. Uh, you know, it got misquoted that he thought LeBron James was better than Michael Jordan. What he was said was, at the end of his career, in his years he did, his numbers are going to surpass Michael Jordan. And that don't mean necessarily that he's going to be better than Michael Jordan. <laughs> he explained it in uh, 2012. And he was misunderstood, like I said. And he said, I never said that LeBron was the greatest. That was never said. Pippa said on the Waddle and Silver show on ESPN 1000. I said by the end of his career, his numbers will be better. And I still stand by that. I think LeBron numbers are scared, uh, crazy only because he he's going to get in more years than Michael Jordan. <laughs> well, okay, we can see that. We can see that. Michael probably uh, really only played 11 years in this league. And when you look at the kid like LeBron, who started 18, 19 years old, he's probably going to pass Michael Jordan by his numbers in his first 10, 11 years in the league. <laughs> uh, but things got really awkward after that. With Scotty being asked who he picked to run his mate or wingman between him, him and M, uh, MJ and Braun, his response couldn't even come clear. He said, that's a dumb question. I've never done anything with LeBron. I want to take LeBron to the movies with me. Everybody throwing that flame on your boy. I mean, everybody throwing that flame now. Now, Scottie Pippen throwing that flame. 
Mm. Mm, 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 mm. What do y'all think, peeps? You think LeBron could have played back in that era? You know, without mounting up trying to go play with other people? I'm sorry, you just didn't get that in the old NBA. You didn't get that shit like what the uh, Phoenix Suns are doing and, and the Utah Jazz are doing. That's what motherfuckers like. Teams with identities. You know what I'm saying? But I'm loving my Knicks are starting to buy into that identity. Even though they lost to the Suns today, but we was on a nine game winning streak. I take that. I take that all day. I take nine game winning streaks all day. You hear me? Yes, 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 yes. I will take that. But anyway, y'all need to leave me some comments. Let me know what you think about this article. Was Pippen wrong? Was he right? How do you feel about it? Do you think Pippen was hating? Or was he just telling the truth? I don't know. Peace and the Bob Haggers, people.